Lymphomatoid papulosis patients need to know that they have a, they have a relatively rare and unique skin condition uh, that is a marker of risk for lymphoma. I think that first and foremost, the lymphomatoid papulosis needs to be treated in an appropriate manner. Patients may get a few lesions uh, or patients may get lots of lesions. Lots of lesions that break down get secondarily infected. So the aggressiveness of the treatment of lymphomatoid papulosis needs to be individualized to each patient and each circumstance. The second thing is that regardless of what treatment we use for lymphomatoid papulosis, how aggressive we are or not aggressive, it had, the treatment of lymphomatoid papulosis has no impact on the future risk of developing a lymphoma. And so it really is, I'll say, symptomatic relief of the skin lesions and that um, uh, there really is nothing we can predict that will tell us uh, that a lymphoma may or may not be coming down the road in up to 10 to maybe 15% of the time. Mm -hmm.